was looking at, and I think a lot of PTs are, at anything that would bring in something outside of the insurance base business. Um, massage, exercise class, um, personal training, that kind of thing. Definitely having the, the gravity classes is an edge on my competitor um, because it's, it's something different. It's, um, it's that extra bit of attention to our clients from a whole nother uh, point of view, from a whole nother avenue, which is more fitness instead of just rehabilitation. Put this back foot out just a little bit, so toward my hand. When we hit the ground running two and a half years ago with the gravity class, it just went gangbusters. It was it was such a pleasant surprise to something that I'd envisioned and I wanted to do and I put it out there and it was received better than I thought it would be. We talked it up a lot. We told our physicians about it, told our patients about it, told you know people that live in the neighborhood about it and had the instructors here, had the machines down. They came to see the clinic and see what we did with it, but we got as many people on as we could and we're like, ah, oh, you know, try this. And they were signing up and putting their deposits down that night. The nose heels all the way through, all the way through, there you go. I think we get a lot of crossover where people are coming, they, they do one and then need the other or they need one and they see it and do the other as far as, as being a patient and wanting to try a gravity class or being a participant and then something happens. Up on those tippy toes. I can think of offhand, and this was two and a half years ago, at least five people that weren't patients and either they or their son or daughter or their spouse or somebody else became a patient. I had made a big enough profit off it in the first year to pay for the equipment. A lot of it's word of mouth, and if you can get your name in a, a local email group where all the, the moms email the latest happenings in the neighborhood, it's free, and, and that's where I think you get the most uh, reward. To sustain it, you've got to keep marketing it, and you've got to be hungry for it, and you've got to You've got to have somebody who, who has that drive. It's as much as you want to make of it. It's, it's as big as you can dream it. You can probably have that. You just have to, to kind of create the avenues and, and be hungry for it.